the referee, Mr. Ishmael Huwadi. Taking a look at the boxers, on my right, he weighed in at 56.7 kilograms. He's wearing black, green and gold trunks. I beg your pardon, he's wearing white trunks. Hailing from Johannesburg, his record stands 17 fights, 16 wins, one loss and 11 KOs. Put your hands together for Dakalani, the Planthan, Govu. <laughs> On my left, he weighed in at 56.7 kilograms. He's wearing black, green and gold trunks. He hails from Whitbank, Bumalanga. His record stands 17 fights, 16 wins, 8 KOs and 1 draw. Rank number 8 by the WBC. The SA featherweight champion, Anthony the Blue Jaguar, Tasha. Boxes. Boxers, you know the rules. Obey my command at all times. Chickens and good luck. Final instructions from our referee of this uh, South African featherweight title fight about to get underway. Quite remarkable, Elliot, that both men have had 17 fights and 16 victories. One, uh, of course, the difference being Tesh has had a draw and his clover has one defeat. Well, as if that's enough, Babs, if you look at the weight, both men well within the weight limit, so really not too much of an advantage or a disadvantage. Well-matched boxers, and uh, we should uh, really see a great fight here today. And Glover, he's in the white trunks, boxing from an upright stance. <laughs> Working from behind that left jab. Tesla a little wild with his punches, but that's his style. He's uh, quite often switches from orthodox to unorthodox. He'll do anything to try and confuse his opponent. Right to the jaw, puts him on the canvas. Is he going to beat the count? He looks as though he is desperately hurt. I don't think he's going to make it. Incredible punch coming from Takalani Zofu. One punch, bet. It doesn't happen. It seldom happens in that great fight that uh, one man can throw. One punch, and that is it. Finishes off the fight. Well, incredible performance there by Takalani Zofu. Kept his composure, and uh, he did the job. Well, it'll be interesting to see in how many seconds did he do this job. Well, it's not too many, I can tell you that. We'll get the time shortly. A one-punch knockout by Takalani and Glover. And he is the new South African featherweight champion. Well, a win is something else, Pat, but this man did it in great style. And uh, Anthony Tesla is still uh, lying there on the canvas. And uh, the Dr. Peter Ngatana is uh, there to ensure that uh, this young man is in uh, no danger at all. But uh, it seems to me that uh, he's fine. It was a punch, a straight right hand that caught him. And I'm sure in a short while we'll have the benefit of looking into that uh, great, incredible puncher uh, that uh, caught him. Dakalan and Lovu becomes uh, the new South African featherweight uh, champion. There you see the former champion. Interesting to see that in a couple of seconds we have an ex-champion bet. Well, here's a replay. Watch carefully what happened. There's a the right hand. Flush on the chin. Beautiful right hand from Inglover. And uh, Chesto went down onto his side. Never made any attempt to beat the count. And Look at the, the focus uh, on their eyes and the face of uh, Takalani Dovu. And that punch uh, lands a flush on the button. He measures this man with the left hand. He measures this man once again. Not too many punches were thrown in that round. And he throws that right hand. Bang, wow. the man go down. What a beauty. You don't see too many right hands like that, I tell you. And uh, <laughs> Takalani and Glover, all credit to him. All credit to him. Well, Anthony Tesla back on his feet, and that's good to see. But unfortunately, without his South African featherweight title. Well, if there are fights that have got to go onto the awards,